everybody, welcome back to another episode of Infiltration. So we've jumped planets, we're now at Horde. All the mechs are repaired, the, the crab is now in storage. So I didn't change any mechs between the last episode, we just didn't really have the sea bills to do a whole lot. I was hoping we could sell some stuff to get the Centurion, uh, XL engine the Centurion, but it's just not going to happen. Like if we go, go to refit, I'll show you what I mean, it's just so much to add a, an XL engine this thing right now, right? So 857,000, it's a fair bit. We get some more, we get a lot of great weight to be able to add stuff to this thing, but right now, like we could do that and then we would drop the uh, 250 core in here, right? That's the ultimate goal. Um, we can easily make this weight up. So, because we've got uh, patchwork materials and stuff we could throw in if we had to, right? Um, easily making the weight up. But right now, uh, 1 million, we just don't have it, right? So we're going to hold off. And there's an awesome mission on this planet that I want to take that I think we can probably do. So we're going to go to the command center. We've got a three skull mission here. Let's take it because it's going to be challenging. Price of discretion is an escort mission in an urban environment. I've never done an escort in an urban environment, so this should be interesting. Um, so we just need to escort a clan wolf uh, um, personal friend um, and looks like they got mercenaries coming down to interdict the shipment. I think we should probably be okay at three skulls on an escort mission. The fact that the, the lances are coming in um, as we go along rather than having to deal with them all at once. I think this will probably be to our advantage. So I'm going to take this mission to see how we do. So we're going to negotiate this. We're going to go full salvage on this because, you know, it's a good payout. That should cover our drop in repairs, I think, unless someone takes a lot of damage. Uh, but this is really what we want, the good salvage. So we're going to accept this. And we're going to go standard lance again. Oh, actually, before we do this, uh, I should probably check the barracks here because I think some of our guys have got the ability to raise some stuff up. So we can go guts here. Overheat threshold, I think is probably a good idea. All the lasers we're running. I know I was saving this for gunnery, but I think... Um, I'm going to go six across the board and get that overheat threshold. Uh, now, Hellion, we can't do much until... I mean, we could go plus 10% maximum sprint. Uh, or do we wait? We're so close for max gunnery. Let's just wait for max gunnery. All right, we want to go... Um, we got 10k on you. I think we were talking about gunnery, so let's do that. Confirm. And Goofy, I think we're going gunnery, so we're gonna wait. Uh, duck, 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 goose. Uh, let's go with gunnery. Bonus of increase. Well, that range is what? Yeah, minus one recall penalty. You are a missile boat. Max evasion. I don't know. I think we go this route. Let's go gunnery. Let's confirm that. And Dallas. Oh, finally. Beautiful. Take that for sure. Excellent. Alright, let's move out. Um, I think we're going to be okay. Fingers crossed. Let's do this. Command interface initiated. Okay. Time to earn our money. It sure as hell is. Okay, we're gonna go up there. Now, my question is, where do we escort them out of here? Will it be that way maybe, or? Down here maybe? I don't know. Okay, what are we dealing with here? Trebuchet, weak armor, a warrior. Uh, okay. Yeah, they've got uh, immunity, so let's let's do 
going to uh, give them the first uh, pop shot here. See what happens. Is this a hyper pulse generator? And why am I standing on it? Not amazing chances to hit, but uh, let's see what we can do on this guy. Oh, the LRM's hit. Beautiful. Oh my god, yeah. One for the nice job, buddy. Yes, Gonna marry this guy. Gonna marry this guy. Not gonna take those shots, there's no point. You're gonna pay for that though. Commander. Sorry, buddy. Gonna show this guy what we think of him here. He didn't move, so it's time to die. Wake up! Time to die. You got time to use Warlord again later? There it is, folks. Friggin' shredded him. Alright, let's get moving. There's gotta be two other guys around somewhere. Got anything on Sansa? Doesn't look like it. Alright. They ain't coming out to play yet. Roger. Oh, there we go. A light carrier, huh? Three ballistics. Let's just see if we can get the streaks on them. Nah. Nah. Full eh, yeah, no, I think we'll wait. I could have targeted the ground with the arrow, but meh. Looks like a centurion here too. Yep. It's not in a good position though. He went on 22, so we're okay here. Now we have... Do we have any guys with us? We don't. Good. They'll just freaking slow us down. Uh, you got the carrier, buddy. You're a terrible shot. Okay, good. At least you get one kill this game. Enemy unit destroyed. Commander? I'm there. Gonna leave the tag off. Hammer him! Okay, he's got light goss. He's running. He's running. I don't blame you. Shouldn't turn your back though. Yes, Commander. Firing jump jet. Ah, leave the barrage off. We don't need it right now. It's fire. Locked on rear arm. Streak hit, beautiful. All right, hammer him. All weapons are go. I'm listening. Full speed sounds good. Uh huh.
Sure. Wow. A lot of misses. A lot of damage. Waiting for orders. See if we can end this fast here. Gonna leave the medium lasers off, but let's go to the uh, Artemis and fire. Beautiful. Enemy down. Okay, now I have no idea where these guys are going to move from. So we're going to put you over here. Because you're fast. Get you here to activate. Awaiting orders. Let's get you here. Be there in a jet. Like I said, I have no idea which way they're going to be going, so. Okay, you go here. Bet you they're going the other way. Good to go. On the move. Full speed. Find out soon enough. Yeah. Full speed sounds good, uh-huh. Alright, where are they? Oh, they're going that way. Because of course they are. Got targets. Chapa. They shouldn't go very far because we're right here. If they move at all. They'll probably move up into here, but we'll see. So they're going over here. So we got two choppers. Okay. Make sure you guys just stay there, man. No. Another chopper. So this is going to be a lousy three skull if these. this is all they've got. Hopefully they got a good lance at the end here. Come on, let's go, guys. Move it. Hawk Moth, 25. No idea what these guys are. We're still a couple turns away from engaging these guys, man. Our, the bulk of our forces, that is. Prowler. Nightshade, okay. Ooh, three hits, nice. What do they got here? Fire starter? Is that an OG fire starter? 9 prime. Yes, Commander. O G Killer. Original gangster man. Ah, uh, this guy's dead. Roger that. Nope. More armor than I thought. That hit something good. Good shooting though, Tex. Now I could go this way. Full but I better go this way. I think. Right here. Mm -hmm. Full speed, uh-huh. Roger that. Don't like these narrow streets, man. I'm receiving you. Double time. Let's go. You have orders? I do. Light. 
Lightning McQueen. Yes, come in. I'm dead. All right, let's target this guy. See if we can pull him out of the battle. Oh yeah, we should be able to. Yeah, beautiful. Probably had a tag barrage or a tag arrow or something on him. Looked like he did anyway. Who knows? Who knows? Good to go. Can't take on this hawk moth, eh? How come? We can now. Let's move. Surprise, motherfucker! I got me. Beautiful. Okay, Dallas is up front. Let's get her forward. Just going to walk it up. We're going to leave the barrage off, I think. Let's hope we get lucky on this. One hit. So far behind. Let's reserve. Reserve. How, How far can you get up here? Oh yeah, nice. Yes, Commander. Nice! Okay. Target him and fire. That's one less chopper. As far as you can go, please. I got it. Don't think. Don't shoot. Just run. Just get your ass up there. Dance your ass off to this funky music. Yeah, it's raining. So we've got two mechs in storage. We got the OG fire starter, 45 tonner, and we've got the uh, crab now. That would make for actually half decent second lance. Is the uh, centurion, the archer, the crab, and the um, OG fire starter. Uh, can we sprint through these guys now? Yeah, we've opened up the space. Let's just get up to here. Nice. Well, that's still a long way away. I mean, we got to open up uh, a few more things to get that second lens functioning. Ah, oh, for Christ's sake. I thought he would have moved and gone up behind everybody else, but no. Let's just go over there. Oh, for crying out loud. All right, Gundal, looks like you're staying back. This should be interesting though, because uh, we're going to have our lead vehicles activating the dropship, and then we're going to have lances attacking them, or a lance at least. Let's hope for some heavy mechs, get a good fight in. Alright, um... Let's work on this OG. Put the barrage on him. Oh, camera shake. What's up, boss? You know what's up. That's what's up. Right here. Going full throttle. Here it comes, folks. Now let's see how you handle this. Target's taking a critical hit. His arm just came off. All right, let's get out of the way of these vehicles if we can. You can't shoot. So let's just stay on this side of the road. 
How far can you get? Not very far. Let's go in the water. Alright, Goofy, how far can you get? Not very far. Let's go in the water. Gonna run for it. All right, you don't move. Actually, get over on this side of the road. Hopefully, we're not too far away from those vehicles. Let's drop some stuff on this guy. Engage. Bring the rain, baby. See ya. Oh, is he still alive or no? No, he's gone. Beautiful. Good. The vehicles are coming back. Come on, guys. You can do it! There we go. Back on track. Yeah, no, I thought the vehicles would have moved up behind each other, because normally I find they've their movement was um, so linear that they would sometimes stop behind each other rather than going off-road and going around. And maybe that was just a... a uh, number of squares movement thing I don't know but or number of hex movement thing I don't know but um, I thought they would have just stacked up behind each other I didn't think they would try and tr find another way around All right, I have no idea Got it. where enemies may show up up here yeah. let's get the big guns up uh, let's get up over here far forward as we can go I think without blocking them yes, Commander. it's a good thing let's get over here inside these buildings here I'm gonna turn the camera slightly uh, it's a good thing that we've got an LRM Mac that can just kind of stand back here Let's just move into here. On my way. That'll put everybody in uh, visual range of view so they can move. All right, here we go. What was that? Preta C. Come on, you guys, move it. We're not woefully out of position, but the Preta 45 tons, Raptor 2, and an as uh, an Ansi. I want to call it Anasazi, but I know it's not Anasazi. An Ansi. An Ansi. That's our drop ship. So th this is a really light three skull compared to the last one that we took. Which is like lulling me into this false sense of security. Alright, let let's let these guys know that we're here. Right, there should be somebody else. I would have thought they would have had somebody else. They're probably stealth or something. Okay, I'm going to turn the camera again a little bit here. Let's target this guy with everything. We can put the tag on him as well. All weapons committed. Explosions. Explosions. Ho, ho, holes. En français. Mm, really bad chance to hit, but we're going to take him. Firing. Uh, I meant to knock that building down. Just want to see if there's anybody behind him. Alright, let's get you... Just walking. There's no point in sprinting. You're going to be shooting at range anyway. What do we got here? Six, eight, eight. Let's take it on this guy. He's been damaged already. 
All right. Every little bit counts, I guess. What's the plan? The plan is for you to put down some heat in this guy. Can we stay hidden? We can. Let's force them to move up. Have we got another blip back there? We do. Something. It's something. Ah, oh, God. Lousy chance to hit. We're just going to take it anyway. Confirm. I have one hit. Commander. You know what to do. Oof. Sure. Get within striking distance. Firing. Locking in all weapon systems. Negative damage. Yeah, well you're in striking distance. Yeah. Put that mech in the trees. Gonna leave it on three and fire. Streaks hit, beautiful. I think I hit something special. You sure did. Alright. Not really worried about what that last mech is. I don't think it's gonna be a heavy. Definitely a medium, but not a heavy. I think if we can focus fire one at a time, we should be fine here. The Preda and the Raptor are out of position. Take the Anazi down. Ananzi. And then whoever decides to stick their neck out first, rip his head off. And then the rest of these guys will just fall like, like, I don't know, wheat in a field that's being harvested. Something like that. Yeah, that's it. Man, I still remember... <laughs> I still remember that uh, that episode we faced uh, the Dire Star. We lost the Orion to the Dire Star, and I was like, "How can you not like?" I I I gotta say I hated the fact that I lost the Orion, but I really enjoyed the fact that it was it was Beef's Dire Star <laughs> that took it down. Because, like I said, if you've never watched that video, I just I just can't stop laughing every laughing every time I see it. Face the storm. Watch out, guys. Beef's running in his 10, RE, 10 ERPPC tricked out direwolf. <laughs> Nobody kills the beef but beef. You have died from overheating. You get like two shots. Oh, it's an Irby. You get like two shots of the darn thing and then that's it. You're dead from overheating. But still... Uh, sorry, that's that's two alpha strikes. But it's pretty much a one-shot kill. You figure a PPC doing 15 damage times 10 is 150. One location, it just shredded. I think it's 11, though. I don't think it's 10. I think it's 11 ER PPCs. Alright, let's... Uh Move forward and start bringing some pain on these guys. I want them gone now. Yeah, this guy didn't move, so let's shred him. Okay, I'm shocked that we got him, but he is running on XL, so... It's his problem. All right, firing on the Raptor. Let's see how you like this. Beautiful. Yes, Commander. All right, keep moving it forward. Mm, let's sprint a bit, I think. Get a little further up. Aye, aye. And I think we drop it on the Raptor. Yeah, it's the best best choice. Nice. Solid connection on that one. Waiting for orders. 
Okay, let's bring it up. I have no idea what this urban mech is. RLG. I'm sure people are snickering at this point. I have no idea, but we're going to fire on this guy. Goes his arm. He's unsteady. Alright, let's see if the streak 15... Oh, we can get a good shot on B with it. Let's go this route. Okay, nice. Finish off A. I wanted to make sure it was gone. Nice. Plus 47 heat. Beautiful. It's exactly what I was looking for. Hopefully, whatever that mech is, he won't be shooting. Oh. He's definitely not shooting. Let's give it to him. There is. I guess we'll never know what it was. I guess we never will. It went zip when it moved, pop when it stopped, and exploded when it stood still. Well, somebody's got an AMS. Let's see what he does. If he decides he's going to move forward or not. Probably. Could be a hero and try and target one of the vehicles. Nope. <laughs> he's running. He's running. Chase his ass down. Run his ass down. Gun his ass down. Firing. Wow, no streaks, eh? Alright. Hmm. Leave the barrage off, I think. Firing. I should have used Warlord. Oh, pilot lethal damage. We took his head right off. Beautiful. All right, let's get over here. We're done, man. We just got to stand around and watch these guys leave. I don't think we took any damage from those guys. Come on, okay, it looks like you're out. Looks like he's out. We'll see. Yep, yeah, four or five. Beautiful, there it is. Ha, <laughs> perfect timing. Objective secured. I think that should be it, right? There it is, folks. Mission successful. So I think overall that worked out pretty well. Got some good sea bills out of that. Took a little bit of damage, but not much. Great experience, though. Okay. Two trebuchet parts. We don't have... Well, we do have parts of the Preta. We could take two Preta parts and sell it. Which I think is what we'll do. AMS Mark II. Ooh. As far as that, any incoming missiles. Intercept chance 30%. Fires 20 shots. Generates 2 heat. We're sorely lacking AMSs, but this guy's got an ATM may as well, eh? A light AC2. Four tons. 
660 meters. Interesting. Light P Ooh, excuse me, light PPC, 30 damage, 4 tons. Medium X pulse, mortars, plasma lance. So another thing I'm going to get into the other in the other uh, series is mortars. Immune to AMS. It's kind of nice. Tags, we've got TSAMP cannon. Mm, we've had some negative problems with this in the past, so I'm going to leave that for now. Blue field shield dampener, eh? Minus one accuracy when active, but 30% resistance against energy-based attacks when active. I haven't even been acting, activating what we already have for crying out loud. Chameleon LPS. Wow, okay. 12 fixed slots reserved. This thing is great for a long range uh, pinpoint damage mech. Jammer bubbles. Sensor step. Look at this thing. I don't know. I think I don't know. <sighs> Let's take it. I think we can leave the AMS out for now. We don't we don't need it. Like it's not one of those things where I'm going, oh man, I have to have an AMS. I'm sure as we get heavier and heavier, uh uh, mechs will definitely need it, but right now, mm, don't really. How much is this worth? Two and a half million. Gyro defense. Maximum evasion and plus one evasion pips for movement. Defense against being hit. Oh, so much good stuff. Prototype double heat sink. Uh, I should really. Oh, prototype double heat sink kit. I'd love to know what mechs these were on. Range finder, gunnery. I think we do this. This is an immediate upgrade. The prototype double heatsink kit, well, it's nice. Without the extra prototype double heatsinks, you just don't have the ability to utilize it to its full potential. So I'm going to put this in for now. Let's see what else we got here. Signature dampener. Sixty percent sensor stealth. Initial signature reduction. It's not as good as the uh, chameleon LPS, but it's still pretty nice. Um, talons upper spiked. I don't know what mech had these. Void system. God, look at all the stealth stuff. All right. Well. I could sit here all day debating over what's the best pieces to take, but I think I'm going to go this route. See what we get off the Preta. All right, fire starter part. That's not bad. ATM nine. We got the AMS. That's nice. Learn fifteen. Couple things of endo steel. Artemis four. It wasn't a bad rule overall. A lot of the stuff isn't really like we can't use it right away, but it's stuff we can store for now. So not too bad, I guess. All right. Uh, yeah, 19,000. That's not bad at all. So that's a good payout for us. Five days of repairs in total. Beautiful. All right. Um, let's just take that. I wrapped up that job you asked for. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. All right. 15 days to financial report. We're going to be bankrupt, but we've got lots of stuff to sell. So let's have a look. Uh, let's bring that Preta up. Oop, not Merrick's. Mech Bay. Mech, oh, what, 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 what? Say what? Who's this? Infl I thought we had enough. Oh, man. You psyched me out. She's almost got enough XP. We're holding on. Uh, I think we're going to go... Yeah. Gonna do that for now, uh, and then Dallas is fine. All right, so uh, McBase Preda. 
let's bring that forward. Uh, where are you here? Medium. Eh, crab. Where's the preta parts? Should say three or three. There it is, folks. Lower left stabby. They're running technology from a research outpost, eh? Let's have a look. Come on, bees. That's a bizarre looking mech. I mean, I guess it's okay. Just weird ass looking, that's all. Uh, let's refit this thing. Contraband fire control system. What the hell does this thing have on it? ATM-9. Nice. The voice system, which was completely obliterated here, it looks like. Signature dampener, which is obliterated. Well, let's just do this. Yeah, so light PPC, RE medium laser, which we've already got a couple of. Radical prototype double heatsink kit. Beautiful. We get that, too. C3 slave, AMS. So this is a good windfall for us. Contraband <laughs> fire control system. Plus one accuracy. One recoil with ranged weapons. But if you're using weapon heat generated though, it's hotter, but it's more accurate. It's a good thing this guy didn't fire on us. I think we're gonna I think we're gonna um scrap this guy. Because we've already got a 45 ton shell. Oh, this is an Omnimech, right? No, it's not. Because the engine's not installed. Although it is for the hard points, but... Upper spike. These are all fixed, too. It's a melee mech, looks like. Retractable blade. That's, what, one ton? 0.6. Yeah, two tons of stuff on the shoulder, on the arm. Um, I think we're going to scrap it. We need the C-bills. I think we'll, we'll get the prototype double heat sink, the ATM-9, all that stuff. So let's go ahead. I know people are cringing at me doing this, but 1.2 million. Let's scrap it. Because that's going to be a uh, core for the uh, Centurion. All right, let's have a look real quick here. If there's anything quick we can take, maybe a quick stand-up fight. Penitent Justice 521. Escort mission, no. Raiding party? Um, intercept a pirate lance. Test drive, mopping up. Wolf lance, escape battlefield. Two of nine, though, weakest link. It's an assassinate. Uh... Sure. Let's do this. Um, let's get it done fast. It's going to cost us for the drop, but that's fine. Alright, here we go. Bet you it's going to be two lances. Or two stars, that is. Ten against six. Take those odds any day. All right. Full Nothing. All right. Commander? All right. That's all right. So we can get some stuff to sell here. We'll have enough to to uh, get that Centurion engine in. Although I'm wondering if it's a better idea to use it on something else. Roger. Full speed. I don't know. We'll see. Centurion's it's doing okay. Other than the speed, it's doing just fine. Mm -hmm. The rack is completely devastating when it's in range. Yeah, most likely we're going to be against two lances here. Alright, I want to get in on these guys. Let's get up here. Okay, sensor traces. What do we got? Grinner. 
Incubus can't be that tough. Chiquita. Chiquita. All right, let's just deal this guy a death blow. We're going to go with the arrow as well. Or maybe not a death blow. But you can finish it up. All right, Doc, he's all yours. Oh, out of range, out of ranges with the pulse, eh? Really? Engaging with target. Scored a critical hit. Button action two. Wonder if that other guy's in range of the swarms. Don't think he is. But let's try it. I have no idea with these numbers, who's hitting what. I don't know, who knows. It's a lot of engine crits. That's a lot of engine crits. Alright, let's hammer this guy. We'll use the barrage as well. See ya. Told you we were looking for a quick mission. Uh, let's go after this guy. He's just been standing here too. Yeah, really? Well, will Warlord get a better chance to hit? Not much, but a little better. Take this. Whoops. Don't have to. Your mech does it for you. What are you complaining about? I don't know why you're so worried. <laughs> ah, that's so awesome. He goes up. He comes down. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. What do you think, Earl? Take that guy. Chiquita hasn't gone yet, so let's go after him. Oof, let's wind it up. And warlord it because we can. See if we can shred this guy. Here it comes. I'm guessing you didn't like that, did you? I, I don't think he did. Oh yeah, here comes the vultures. What the hell's that guy got? A mortar, probably? It's still bizarre to see the gladiator and not think it's a 75 ton mech. Yeah, they gotta be firing mortars. Oh, he's gone. Alright. Shoot him. Oof, really. Alright, firing. What's the plan? You know the plan, Stan. Kill the man. Make him understand. Damn, son. Mission successful. Alright, well there's a quick piece of work for a hundred grand. I don't think we got hit, so... Should be fine. Some half decent XP. Do we have any mechs that we can finish? Doesn't look like it. Clan ER large, that's a possibility. Oh, clan medium pulses as well. Active probes. Oh, that's a beautiful core.
can't use it in anything right now, but it's still a beautiful core. Uh, clan double heat sinks. Clan large. Medium pulse, I think. Sure, see what else we got. Two incubus parts, Jakeda part, Grinner part. We've got the other medium pulse, beautiful. And the core, awesome. All right, there we go. Beautiful. Oh yeah, it was we damaged ourselves, right? What do you do, right? You know. All right, so we're going to end the episode here, guys. I'm going to have a look at what we can do for the Centurion. I don't know what I don't know whether I want to spend the time in the C builds right now and get it updated, but we are pretty darn close to being able to do that. Um, but I'll also see what the options are for our other mechs. Maybe the XL engine is better served than something else. I don't know. The Centurion is pretty slow. Even if we drop the XL and a 240 engine in there, even, we can pull some heat sinks and then we have some space for other stuff. Like maybe upgrade the S the Streak 4 to a Streak 6 or an SRM 6 or something. Don't know yet. About to see. Um, or maybe we put some longer range, like maybe we put the ER large on there as well. I don't know. But I think the rack is good enough. I don't think we need the ER large. But we'll figure it out, alright? I'm going to take a look at that between episodes, okay? So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.